This young barn owl was rushed into the centre after a member of the public found it alone on the ground. It was quickly taken over to the vet team so they could check it over. Three hundred thirty is not a bad way for for a juvenile. She's still uh, she's still growing. She's a bit dehydrated. Can you see the skin that is quite um, green? Yeah. But the body condition is not bad. That's fat in there. Right. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna leave it in the, in the incubator for now. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna prepare some subcut fluids yeah. just to um, correct that mild dehydration. But apart from that, she seems to be okay. So yeah. that's good news. The people that brought it in, uh, they know where the box is, they know that the parents are around, so we're gonna try and put her back. That's it. Well, this isn't actually a rescue release, but we had a barn owl brought in this morning. It's juvenile. They brought it in because it was down under the bottom of a tree. Um, they weren't sure if it was injured or not, but we reckon it was just a branching because it's in good condition. So it's going straight back out to where it belongs to its mummy and daddy. Yeah, Beautiful, yeah, isn't it? About nice. five, six years ago, we put right. a load of nesting boxes around the farm. Cool, good boy. So environmentally friendly, I like that of a farmer. Yeah. So basically, this bird table here, every night, we put about five or six chicks up there. That, that, cool. There's a box there. There's one sitting up there, look. That's a dove. Oh, is it? Yeah. I've got a new pair of glasses. Okay. <laughs> so should we put him in where the other ones are hissing? I don't know which side they are. You go back to your brothers and sisters, little bar now. I don't know how you're going to put it in the box. Do you want to do it? You can I'll do it if you want to, young man. I'll put the ladder for you. Look. Isn't he very handsome? Look at that. Look. Do you know their <laughs> ears are the same size as ours, but you can't see them. They're in there, and one set forward and one set back and they can hear cotton wool falling through the air. So when you go in the house tonight, get your mum to get a bit of cotton wool and you shut your eyes and she'll, you can tell her when it's falling through the air. There you are, young man. Hello. One bar now. I don't have to climb a ladder, which is a great bonus. You can go in with your brothers and sisters. And we'll see if his parents come back. To our surprise, both parents flew out from the box, circling around the area to see what we were doing. We wanted to make sure that the youngster was accepted back without conflict, so we found a quiet place to hide and waited. After checking that the youngster was okay, the adults set off once more to continue the night's hunting. What a beautiful sight. If you like our videos, please subscribe to our channel by pressing the red button. And make sure you hit the bell to get notifications of our latest content. If you want to help us save wildlife, please donate. Every pound you give will help us to save more wildlife.